friends and welcome to Mystic Star Magic. Today we're going to have a lot of fun as we find out what's happening with you this week. So this is our group one. This is group two. This is group three. And we're going to kind of just get into it. Um, just hi to everybody who's new and hi to all my old friends. I'm so happy that you are here. We have oracle cards, tarot cards, and of course our sprinkle of charms with divination dice and pins all gathered together. Um, if you want to book a personal reading, check the description down below. If you want to, um, donate to the channel, that's also down below. The information is all down below, below and always welcome to do so. And just thank you so much for being here. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and take a deep breath in. Close our eyes. And now as we exhale... Choose whichever pile draws you to it. All right, let's do this. Hello, group one. So you chose this beautiful card, which is all about the Raven of Truth. I'm like, it's not even doing now, like Raven of Truth. So truth is important. This, this week is all about this. It's about being sincere with your emotions, being sincere with your um, intentions as well. So like whatever you are intending, um, let it come from a place of truth. And and since it's also the raven, it's so like I'm also feeling like a little bit of our shadow selves coming through here. So that that's the truth of ourselves. We have our shadow sides and that's okay. We don't have to like, it's not something we need to hide. But rather I almost feel like remove the mask is what I'm hearing here. Let's go ahead and six of six of swords energy are moving away from something the magician we're manifesting things this week as well and we also have wow ace of swords again that's the truth coming through you're getting the sense of clarity and it's helping you move on from something it's like you're moving on from a situation that wasn't really helping you um and now you have the sense of clarity coming through ace of swords and it's helping you to like do the mat like start manifesting um so having the sense of clarity having the sense of truth like i really feel like taking off that mask and being who you're meant to be this is where your power lies this is where you like and you're so i feel like you're walking away from like like the hidden aspect of your like not like putting on the mask you're being more who you are meant to be there is also great progress because we're going from the ace all the way to the six of swords so there there is progress and so this truth is helping you move on from something and again like i said this is the power that you are you are the magician you have the ability to manifest the things that you want but it comes from a place of truth it comes from a place of clarity it cannot come from any other place so if you're wearing a mask, if you feel like you, if you're trying to like uh, appease others um, by wearing a mask, by not being who you're really meant to be, that is not where your strength lies. Your strength lies in the truth. And it might be even from your, even if, if the truth is a little shadowy as well. So that's here. So we have cleaning up, purification of self and self-improvement, detoxifying of negativity. We are releasing maybe old patterns. We're walking away. We're but we're pure, like the self is coming through, cleansing your area, cleansing your thoughts. Um, <clears throat> and here we have envy. So that is something. Maybe you are having envy of somebody, right? or maybe other people are envious of you so it depends um with the shadow self maybe you are having envy of of others and i want you to not feel bad about that that is something that is guiding you it is helping you know what you want envy is not a bad thing envy is a bad thing in terms of like it doesn't feel good it feels uncomfortable but if you can take that knowledge of what that envy is giving you like what is it that you're envious of is it is it like you know like um, it could be like, oh, they have more friends than, than me, right? So that means that what, what really the underlying cause there is that you want more friends. And that's the truth. That's the real truth of it. Not the, So the envy isn't bad. It's telling us what the truth is, right? So focus on it. Listen to it. And, 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 and like ask yourself, why am I envious of so-and-so, right? If that's, your, if that's the emotion. And if somebody else is envious of you, right? Then acknowledge them. It's like, oh, okay, they're envious of me because you know like maybe they they feel like i have all this stuff and then maybe instead of like being offended to be like okay 
acknowledge maybe be grateful for what you do have not saying that you have to stick around with somebody that's envious that's not a very good situation to stay with but just acknowledging all this because i really feel like even the shadow side is telling us something about ourselves that's going to help us the truth the truth if we drop the mask the truth will like almost feel like set us free here um <laughs> My charms are all the way somewhere or far away. So we'll figure out if I can find the charm chips instead. Um, okay, we'll do charm chips instead today. <laughs> and here I did the whole intro of like, oh, with charms and today. We're just doing charm chips. <laughs> and then we'll get, uh, before we do that though, let's, let's see what we need to have. This is your uh, advice patience you're gonna see me um this is what we need to come everything to accomplish anything everything can be accomplished at nature's pace so don't try to rush it um i think there's a lot of clarity for you and you are clearing a lot of things right you're clearing all those things that are no longer serving you with the truth i have to say that's what i'm seeing here all right let's see what your sprinkle of charm chips is happening with the collective of group okay these are what ones to come out Oops. oh yeah look at this timing comes in again again a sense of needing patience is coming here it's like things are, are kind of working out all by themselves we do have like the winds of change coming um so that's actually quite lovely um 61 is to me uh you are unique yeah and that's all kind of the power of that uniqueness um what i'm seeing here is more like acknowledging really yourself um and in your power in this and that's like and each and in that is the uniqueness that you are we do have number seven so that is like you're on your right path you are like er, I don't know how to like seven is always one of them, one of my favorite numbers but it's it's there's a certain kind of like where you are like even if at times you feel like you're lost or even at times when you feel like oh I'm not doing like the right thing it's like no you are on your path maybe those moments are actually needed for self-reflection even if like let's say if there is envy or um you know you have envy towards others that is actually really, it's not like you're doing anything wrong it's it's more like hey this is telling you something it's just giving you a heads up of what you want or if others are envious of you maybe like oh look look, look having this gratitude for all that you have um maybe even reaching out to those who are envious and be like hey maybe you can have this too i almost feel like for me that seven is you shining your light on the world so very much very beautiful 93 it's all about learning it's about learning about yourself and maybe a lot um learning about your gear especially here about your ability to manifest um so you have this <clears throat> or maybe it's about learning the truth maybe it's actually going deep into those books and, and learning new things i've been reading a lot more books about different things and 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 it really helps it actually makes it almost lets you see the world in a different point of view and different and it lets you see different aspects of like the magic of the world so give reading a try like looking for that learning is important coming through so i think with that i think that is it for you group one thank you so much for being here and sorry that I, there was like a little bit of a cutout um but i truly appreciate you being here sharing your energy sharing your time and of course sharing your journey with me i'm sending you so much love and so much light please consider liking commenting and subscribing until i see you in the next one bye my video friend dear friends so you chose this beautiful card and it's all about ancient oak spirit and this is about strength um i think it's really about the strength of like well there's two different things i think strength in in many ways i want your physical strength because to me the tree also represents um you know our health right so having a strong health how do we have a strong health by taking care of ourselves what that means i'm not really sure in but you know like what i've well i've been kind of playing with that as well 
And I have to be honest, I am, and I'm not preaching that you have to do a certain way, but, but what I've noticed is that when I actually am uh, clean eating, you know, like when I don't eat as much junk because I'm not perfect, I, I still love my ice cream and I still love everything, but as, if I'm not eating as much junk as I, I like, you know, sometimes do, um, when I'm making my, like, for example, instead of making my own food and, and having that, I feel a lot stronger. I feel a lot more like this. And now the other strength that we're seeing here, and this is important for those two things, um, is the strength of kind of your 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 ancestry, your family. Like this is like I almost feel like the door coming through here also like um, can be this week, especially maybe you're connecting a lot to past loved ones because I also see lots of like all this light and I feel like those are all spirits coming through here. So the strength of your connection with that. Um, we are here because of all the, like every, every decision they all made, like our family brought us here. And, and, you know, like maybe you're not close to your family, but they, everything kind of led to you being here and, and our existence is quite beautiful, right? Is that there's magic in all of that. So maybe strengthening that kind of maybe going forth with that as well. Um, let's see what other, let's see what, so this is actually a very, I, I do really like this. It's almost very also grounding. I feel that grounding here. Um, so connecting, I also feel like in dreams, um, I, I don't know. I just feel like they're in like in your dreams or, or somehow like you'll feel that energy, especially of past loved ones here. So, you know, maybe even talk to them a little bit. We have justice. We have the page of pentacles and then we have the four of cups okay i can kind of see why we, we we they might be visiting us here we might be there might be missing like and i love that because you know past loved ones our ancestors always kind of looking out for us right they're always kind of watching us and then we they are seeing that you're missing some sort of opportunity this week and so i feel like that's what it is and we do they're trying to get you to see that there's an opportunity that it is coming your way and with the justice card i almost feel like it's something that you've been striving for it's something that you've been working for um, and this is the karma bringing it here there's a sense of balancing coming through that needs maybe maybe you've been neglecting yourself a little bit I don't know why that is like neglecting a little bit of your health so you've been putting too much effort into one thing and then not having this balance right um or maybe we, we've like because I, I do see the two cats here that I, I do find it funny because it's like shadow and light um and trying to find a balance between that so I feel like almost like this is the junk food and this is the clean eating food and like finding a balance so that you don't, you know, you don't have to be an extreme extremist in any way at all. And then the page of pentacles, which I love this because it's like, <laughs> well, it's like throwing a coin or like in a crossroads here. Um, but for me, the page of pentacles is always kind of like you're at a starting point and you're, you really want to go off. And, and, and kind of learn uh, maybe about finances, maybe just about here with the map in the world. You want to learn more about the world. I almost feel like you can, you don't even have to go out into like out there. I mean, you can, but there is a lot of learning within yourself and within like um, your family. I don't know why family is just a, a big thing here. So maybe even for some of you that are, if you're having like a little bit of, of trouble with family here or, or with like hat like that, it's like it's maybe somebody's making a peace offer and then, but you're still holding on to the past. You're still like holding on to those like moments where, where it is like, nope, like the spirits are going like, that's not it right now. But for me, it really feels like somebody is trying to offer you something. The spirit might be offering you something and you're not, you're kind of like so stuck on this like, how it's supposed to be you're like I, it has to be one of these it can't be just something that's unexpected but this this is what it is there is there is something that is unexpected so be on the lookout for that um and and remember that it's kind of like a good karma that's coming for you and for me it just feels like good luck this week for you <laughs> i don't know why this is like the page of, of pentacles so like yeah and and be if you can um, kind of in this state of 
possibilities like seeing all the different possibilities not being stuck in one 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 thing just allowing things to kind of flow through Let's see what other things are coming dream catcher oh yeah so this is like the definitely for me the dreams are important this week so protecting against harm and negativity ignoring signs and warnings around you and and it can look at that in morning ignoring signs so maybe like there is a sign that you're getting some stuff but you're ignoring it and that's uh, it's coming through here. Let's see where other things is coming. Oh my goodness, I love this. Look, the door to love. So this is this might be the door to love. Now, love comes in many ways, right? It doesn't have to be just romantic love. Maybe it's love from uh, like your ancestors. Maybe it's love from your lo past loved ones. Maybe it's from your actual family members. Um, there is love coming through here. And it's, look at that. It's like filled with joy and happiness. I love this. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my goodness group you are so good let's see what others kindness take a respite by a pond and be kind to yourself and others oh yes uh, <laughs> and that's the that's kind of thing here kind of like allowing things and, and and allowing your kindness because i really do feel like you have a lot of um potential i don't know like and i mean that it in like potential for joy coming through this week let's see what we have for your charm chips oh look at that's creation creativity being my friend movement forward lots of beautiful things we also have pins something important keeping an eye on something that's important maybe going to spending some time enjoying yourself um or maybe getting rid of all the drama right look at this i like this though look we have the eye and then we also have the sunglasses right so maybe this is covering up some sort of thing trying to like again not seeing something like trying to ignore this offer that's being here i'm not sure what is blocking you in terms of like why you why it, i really do think it's like you have a, a you you have a set belief or a set like how it, something has to come about but it's not like the universe is like nope we're going to go a different route so being open having your eyes open available and for you to see like appreciation like appreciate what you have is what i'm saying appreciate all the things that you have because there is strength in here there is like i feel like the grounding coming coming through and it's going to strengthen you so i hope this reading is helpful um and if you liked it please do consider commenting liking and subscribing it helps my channel grow and i love it to watch it grow because i do have the goal of 1000 subscribers by the end of the year so i can have a community tap so we can communicate a lot better <laughs> communication is the key to my friends that's a, that's an important thing as well so communicating is um even like you know especially when we want certain things like communicating with spirit communicating with our ancestors with our loved ones there's a sense of communication that wants to come out for you as well <laughs> sorry that's just one of those messages that just sort of arrived um so thank you so much for being here and sharing your energy sharing your time and of course sharing your journey with me i am sending you so much love and so much light until i see you in the next one bye bye my dear friends Hello my dear friends, I am so happy that you are here. So you chose this refuge. Um, I almost feel like a, it's like, for me, it's almost like this refuge is actually a respite. Maybe you've been working too hard. Maybe you've been kind of going at it here. I almost feel like it's time for you to rest. It's time for you to take a break. And I want you to know why you need that. Because here we have, I feel like this is ideas. This is your imagination. This is all those things that you've been wanting. You've been kind of going at it. Um, you know, like you need a time out for yourself. I mean, connecting to your emotions here in the background. For this creativity, for this, like I feel like ideas to flow naturally, to just kind of like for things to get even better. There's a lot of green hair for also maybe connecting to your heart chakra here. And also just feel like abundance for me. So if you take that, so sometimes this is actually quite funny because it's counterintuitive. Sometimes we like, we feel like we have to like be in a rush. We have to be working all this time all really hard while like, you know, really stressing ourselves out. Um, and in that process, we're actually not allowing abundance in, right? Versus when we kind of slow down, when we kind of decide, hey, you know what? I'm going to make whatever, like, I, I need some time for me. And so we take a break. We, I would say, 
like here for me is like surround yourself by nature go to go out to park like really just take a break it's like I feel like you know pausing breaking from from the the, the you know drive and just kind of take a break go outside look at nature and then this is when all of a sudden like the ideas come flowing all the all the like whatever problems you're having all the solutions kind of start flowing it is that is where where we get this this is I feel like coming through this is also where I feel like in those ideas and in those insights and all that that's where the full abundance really comes in not from the like like stressing yourself out hope that makes sense I do like this energy I, <laughs> creativity right there yeah I, I feel like look at this and this is like the queen of wands so definitely um the energy of an entrepreneur here my friends ace of wands oh my goodness it's almost like right there Oh my god this is beautiful because i because i love this look at this it is um coming through basically that whole thing so ace of wands like new insights new creativity new inspirations coming through i want you to see this and we do have these two beautiful queens so maybe for for some of you actually like um like a lot of feminine energy around you will help you that's i feel like that is true but i feel like for me this is actually you this is your creative aspect you you know like your entrepreneurial self you're like you're just always creating your this, this a passion for life and just the like girl boss like you know like you're the boss right there and then we have the queen of pentacles and this is kind of like the abundance the well-being the groundingness um so action lots of action but it's also kind of here for me it's more like like you said being surrounded by nature kind of enjoying yourself kind of allowing yourself to rest brings about this creativity and abundance because if you actually see this it's like they work really well together these two energies um work are working really well for this creation for this ace of wands for this new beginning of creativity and ideas so really like it kind of just <laughs> it um echoes this so this is what i'm seeing here very beautiful energy we have empathy i feel you um and then we have vulnerable i establish empathy boundaries so now for me this empathy is almost like a sense again i for some of you like possibly connecting to a lot of um, feminine energy here we have like empathy i feel you we have i feel like there's a lot of people like maybe connecting to others who are transforming along with you because we do have the butterflies the lavender here though i have to say because this is the lavender it is really about relaxation um and i also noticed this there's the vulnerable establishment but there's a vulnerability here because look we're in this concrete jungle right this is the concrete jungle there is like no nature there is it's like you are like working that pavement but here is where really where the transformation occurs when you are with nature where you are with in a sense in a sense of relaxation with this lavender again um i almost also feel like connecting to your crown chakra here versus here where it's more like just there's no there's you just kind of left out in the cold here um so for me i think it is really again connecting here with nature oh my goodness and i love this looks like it. i want you to see this it's kind of like the same right it's the same um thing on the bottom here like the the little like concrete so your creativity right this is what i'm saying and, and your success as uh like an entrepreneur it comes from uh, for 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 me it, it does it does need that balance of spending time in nature st spending time um in relaxation right this i almost feel like that nature that it charges you up in order for this fire to continue right so there's a, a that i feel like there's a great sense of balance here um love love, love this let's see what if okay look at this we're changing yes i like this because it's it's like for me it's like you are changing into your true power if we can connect these two energies who you are this light you are going through this you are almost like and and it look at it echoes your change echoes into the into the atmosphere 
So let the winds of change happen. You cannot, this is, I almost want to say, this is not working for you, my friends. This sense of like just kind of hitting the pavement, just keep going, going, going. It's not working for you. We are here again, a sense of like, it is time for you to change. It is time for you to like relax, allow, um, spend some time in nature, allow some healing to happen and really connect, I will, like almost feel like connect to nature and, and the earth. Because then with that change, that's when the real creativity comes, and especially for this week, my friends, an adventure. Live wild and free. Yes. Not not be stuck on this, like, I have to go, I have to do this, I have to do this, I have to do this. Oh, my God, if I don't do this. No, my friends, this is what it is. Life is an adventure. We'll seek it. Seek this this refuge. Seek the nature. Seek the, like, the peace. And then when you do this, and then, like, living wild and free, right? Because... And that's another thing. It's like peace, we often think it's like, oh, no, it's like, oh, we're just mellow. And it can be, but it's like peace can also just give you that sense of freedom, right? It gives you a sense of like, hey, if you don't feel like you have to do A, B, and C, you can give yourself this like a sense of peace comes about. You're like, okay, I don't have to do all of those things right now. Maybe like there's a sense of peace and then you can go and have your adventure. You can be wild and free. Um, so maybe shifting your perspective, maybe shifting your priorities. Um, it's, it's like change is coming here. That's what I what I'm seeing, and and it will make it better for you. It's helpful, not like it's it's not like against things, but for you. Okay, we have drama. We have yeah, moving forward. Diamond money. See, abundance is coming. <laughs> the 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 bat, and then the death card is like needing for transformation again. Um, song cut off the things that you don't need oh look at the piano I th to me piano is against a sense of peace coming through um good luck look at oh my goodness look at that and sense of stability so yeah let go of the drama or possibly for some of you go watch a movie take it easy my friends don't you don't have to be on all the time the motion is like things are moving forward allow things to move forward and the diamond here is abundance pentacle energy again again yeah transformation ending and transformation that's coming through i for me it is just cutting the dead wood cutting what's not what's serving you and this is like and and the beauty of that is that if you cut the dead wood right you can still use it in some way right there there is a purpose there um for it and then with the piano i just i really like enjoy the music of life enjoy the music of nature enjoy it's like it's like you're been so focused on trying to be um quote unquote successful that you've kind of lost what success is for you like you know like success isn't like being busy all the time and then like hitting the pavement all the time it's it's the success comes from hey you know like look i did this and this and that feeling of accomplishment that comes from it you have a lot of good luck coming through here so that i love that um and again this is also like a lot of creativity and then needing a sense of stability and needing a sense of, of almost like you know not not stability coming from from being like it's okay things are going to be okay um even with this change there's there's a, a sense of potential here as well i hope you like this reading and if you did please do consider commenting and subscribing it really helps my channel grow and i'm hoping to get 1000 subscribers by the end of the year it's my little goal um and i know you're definitely one of like a, a go-getter too so but let's take it easy this week, my friends. Let's take it easy um, and allow new energies to come through, beautiful energies to help us so that we keep on growing, that we keep on creating. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here, for sharing your energy, for sharing your time, and of course, sharing your journey with me. Until I see you in the next one, I'm sending you so much love and so much light. Bye-bye, my dear friends. Mm -hmm.